Yep. And we're gonna make a song. Yay. <laughs> Okay, first order of business, the base. Everybody likes basses. It's probably one of the most simplest thing you could make in an instrumental. I don't know, it's just me though. If you know how to use a sound font, then this should be pretty easy for you. You can copy what I'm doing here, you know, for science purposes. So this should start sounding like a, a simple bass line. And we have the bass done. Woohoo! Yeah, 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 yeah! Woo now we're gonna move on to the other instruments. Ooh, scary. So after the bass is done, we can move on to the uh, other instruments. Why do I name it other instruments? I, I don't know. You can duplicate your sound font and um, change it to another instrument, so yeah. And you are also allowed to copy this for science purposes, I guess. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Okay, that should be it. really hear it coming together because you know you know me i'm such a good composer i'm the best i'm the best of everyone we're also gonna clone this one because we also need another instrument for spice i guess you can call it that i guess oh yeah as i do this you can like definitely modify it since it's n i i won't really be uh releasing this but i might you know i might See that guys, I completed it so fast because I'm such a pro. After we do a little arranging, it should sound like this. And that concludes chapter 2. Wow! Drums, wow! Hey, if you if you don't know how drums work, we basically just need kicks and drums. That's basically it. So what you're gonna do here is, I don't know, you, you you can just follow what I'm doing here. And we place the pattern and it should sound like this. But that sounds boring, just kicks and snares. How about we add hi-hats? So that the drums have something to accompany with. Uh, I don't have anybody to accompany with. Again, you can just follow what I'm doing here.
And that's where all that's done. It's just sound like this. Final stretch, guys. It's the vocals. Yay! Okay, so I have two chromatic scales. It's it's my own chromatic scale, and it's also a boyfriend's chromatic scale. Now for the vocals, I don't really know how to explain it. I mean, it's it's the vocals. Um, but what I can say is that y you could probably find um inspiration from other works like Sasa's Mugas or something, and you can definitely implement it in your song. Just modified. Still though, you, you can you can still follow this. So after the vocals are done, we should probably ha um, have this. That's how you make a FNF song. I know this tutorial is probably scuffed, but I mean it's better than nothing though, right? Right? 